So uh, when the, our server came over, she asked us uh, what was going on in the town. Uh, uh, what were the Shriners? Are we, were we Shriners? And she wanted to know all about that. So I explained to her that we're uh, a branch of the Masons and what Masons are, and she didn't know about that. And I told her we we're all Shriners, and I told her a little bit what we do. Jordan related his experience. Uh, yeah, so when I first joined the Shrine five years ago now, I went up and I did a tour of the Montreal Children's Hospital and I met this young little boy, his name is David, he was about four years old and they couldn't understand why his hips kept popping out of their sockets. But then it became apparent that he didn't have hip sockets. So the Shriners took this little boy and his mom, David, up from Toronto to Montreal, did the surgeries, did the post-surgery care, put the mother up for two weeks, and then took them back down to Toronto afterwards, all free of charge. So this, this young lady who was our, our server, when she heard this, she became emotional and uh, she thanked us and, and she went away and then she came back afterwards with a plate. I thought it was going to be our bill. And uh, it, was, it was a plate with five $20 bills on it. And, and I thank you. And when we asked her about that, uh, she said that if she's a single mom, a five-year-old boy, and if her son were to get sick, she would want to have the Shriners Hospitals there to look after him. So that was one of these Masonic moments for us. It was very uh, heartfelt, and it, it really made an impression on us. We were proud to be Shriners that day as we are every day, but mm -hmm. that day was something else. We really reached out to somebody local. And uh, we made a point of <clears throat> getting her information, mm -hmm. her name and her address, contact information. We brought it back to uh, Harry McConnell here in the office and he did send a receipt to her and a couple other little things of information about the shrine. So um, we did some outreach there and we got an unexpected gift for the shrine hospital.